Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel. Today we'll be opening up my Twilight Masquerade Elite Trainer Box. This is the regular trainer box. I already went ahead and took the cellophane off. So I don't see most of them have little designs and a little cover there. I've just been saving all of those. And this is the main reason I always open the ETB is the player's guide. I haven't seen too many of these cards, so a lot of them are going to be new. So, of course, you always have the list. I always use this for my checkoff, but I'm not even going to look at that much. I'm just going to have most of the cards be a surprise. So we'll open this up. I usually just take those out. It have nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Here's nine. There's the card dividers. You got the two different designs. One on the front, one on the back. Of course, you always get your pack of energies. And here's the promo card. And I still wish they would do a little bit better of protecting these. But there's Ogre Pond with the teal mask. Okay. And there's the code card. And then the sleeves. And of course, you got the dice and coins. Set this all to the side. And we'll get started and see what we can get out of these. Aaron, Spinarak, Sandshrew, Dawurumaka, Tatsugiri, Burgaraf, Rye Fort, Enhanced Hammer, Timber, and a Enamorous. Helioptile, Finison, Caretaker, Limet, Hassel, Polyrath, Golipede, Jinx, Lampet, and a Wellspring Mask Ogre Pond. So our first hit is a Terastalized Double Rare. Hey Palm, Polywag, Helioptile, Corefish, Diplin, Chiyu, I'm surprised they actually had Chi Yu as a uncommon. Lucky Helmet. Swana Reverse. Goldine Reverse. And a Teal Mask Ogre Pond. Lampent. Poltergeist. Ducklet. Ninetales. Buck Catching Set. Ambi Palm. Agron, Carmen, Enamorous Reverse, and an Alakazam. I have seen this one, so some of the hollow rares actually look pretty good like this. The Ogre Pond looked pretty good too. Grookey, Venison, Watrill, Glamet, Mightyena, Reverum, Florgus, Tangrowth. Okay, I like that Tangrowth. Got that Monferno. And, ooh, an ultra rare Lana's. Lana, or, yeah, Lana's Aid. Yeah, I'm starting to like more and more of these ultra rares, having more of a background to them. Trevenant, Emolga, Brogadier, Illumis, 
Cook, Clefable, Tatagiri, Luxio Reverse, Lebebe Reverse, and a Heatron. Wacky, Heliolisk, Ducklet, Amolga, Festival Grounds, Glamora, Polyrath, the Ogre's, Ma yeah, Ogre's Mask, a Lucha, and a Monkey Dory. One of the new ones. And it looks like we've got lucky on this one. Just seeing it open in the pack, a little bit of a pink. So that one of the A spec cards. So let's see which one it is. Applin, Nose Pass, Seeking, Sunkern, Brigaraf, Jamming Tower, Glaceon, and we got the Unfair Stamp. So we, in our Temporal Forces, we got a A-Spec card too. So let's see what else we got. That's a Poliwhirl and the Infernate. Infernate. I'm not sure how much this card is, but you'll, you would have seen it pop up on the screen. But I do like these A-Spec cards. I think I got five or six of the one from Temporal Forces and never got a duplicate, so that's good. So I'm surprised I got another one out of an ETB. Okay, we're down to our last pack. Let's see if we can't make that one more hit. Okay, Ralph. Monferno, Nose Pass, Jinx, Hassel, Brute Bonnet, that kind of surprised me. The first ancient card that I've seen in this set. And Ambipom, Wacky Reverse, Nine Tails Reverse, and we're ending it on a Blood Moon Ursaluna EX. I have not seen this one on a couple videos that I've watched either. So all of them that I've seen have been new cards, so I definitely was surprised by these four. Okay, so these were not a very bad ETB at all. Of course, you got the guaranteed promo out of it. The Teal Mask Ogre Pond. Then we got the Wellspring Mask Ogre Pond, so why not get an Ogre Pond out of an Ogre Pond ETB? Then we got that Blood Moon Ursaluna. Still haven't got this one out of the game yet. I'm still working on, on that. Then we got our trainer card, Lana's Aid. And then we also got our first A-Spec. So this was a pretty good ETB to start with, getting four hits out of nine packs. I don't know if I'll open much more of this, if than any. I just couldn't buy any at this time, so maybe later on I'll open some more. But at least it'll be a good start to, my, to the binder. But thank you guys for watching. That'll be all for today, and I'll see you guys in the next one.